This weekend, let's talk about serenity. Serenity is something that when you feel it, you know it, and it is something that in its completeness, you'll remember for a long time. It will stay in you. It will literally recharge you at depth. It says in Psalms 46 verse 10, Be still and know that I am God. Well, that's the key. To still yourself in a time of busyness. To close your eyes even for a moment and remember that God is with you. Be still and just simply think about God. You will feel the serenity of spirit. You'll feel it in a new way as you slow yourself down. People that visit our private retreat center, Hope Hill, they say this all the time. They say that I slowed down and I was able to look out over the river and, and I had a change. Others feel it as they lift their eyes to the grandeur of the mountains. Others feel a deep peace and serenity on sandy stretches of beach. We hear that every year on our spiritual retreat cruise. All of us have times and places that come to mind when we think of deep peace and serenity. Often it helps us to let go of the, the distractions that are busy in front of our eyes and quiet our thoughts and allow our mind to picture some scene that represents peace and serenity to us. And then, as we become very, very quiet and open our mind and heart to God in prayer, the serenity of God's Spirit, which is a miracle in itself, takes over. And it calms our emotions. It lifts our thought, every thought, bringing ease and relaxation to our entire body from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet. You do not need to be at Hope Hill or beside a lake or within the view of a mountain or even on one of our spiritual retreat cruises looking out at the sea or the beach to bring peace to your soul. Always you can find stillness of prayer and you will find that it is a place within you where peace of God itself abides. I pray you feel this in a lasting way this weekend.